Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this video we will see, a new method to install full-fledged Windows 11 on OnePlus 6 and 6T. I have made one video on Windows 11 installation on OnePlus 6 and 6T, but that process required a PC to install Windows 11 on the OnePlus 6 and 6T. So this video is different from the first one. Here are the requirements to install Windows 11. One OTG cable or OTG dongle, minimum 16 gigabytes of pen drive, and one USB hub. And of course, you will need OnePlus 6 or OnePlus 6T. I have a OnePlus 6T. I will demonstrate the installation steps on the OnePlus 6T. Installation steps for OnePlus 6 are the same. As you can see, I'm currently using the latest stock Oxygen No S11. On the OnePlus 6T, Yes, we are going to dual boot Windows 11 on stock Oxygen OS 11. Last time we had dual boot on Pixel Experience Android 11. So let's start the process. Before starting let me tell you. You need to unlock your phone bootloader first. I have already unlocked it so. I'm not going to show you how to unlock the bootloader. You will need some files to install Windows 11. You will need to OHTP file that will contain a bootable boot image and ESO file. And drivers accordingly to your device OnePlus 6. And 60 have different drivers, and also you will need parted file to modify the partitions. I will give the link to all files in the description. So please to check it out. You can see all the files are on the screen. And you need to make two partitions on the pen drive. It will depend on you if you need to make pen drive as a bootable drive. Then you can make partitions on your pen drive as. I have already made the two partitions or can skip this step because we are going to use our phones. Internal storage as a bootable. If you want to make partitions on pen drive, then you will need to make one gigabit separate partition for bootable. And you will need to copy the 2 OHTP file like the boot image. FE on that 1 GB partition, and you can copy other files, like drivers and ESO file into the second partition. Now move on to the process. You will need to install TW or P on your OnePlus phone so let me install it quickly. Now let me clear the command prompt. Now we need to copy the parted file that I have in the description. Let me quickly copy that file into my phone storage. Now as you can see we have copied the parted file in OnePlus 60's internal storage. Now we need to run all this command one by one and do not run all commands at once otherwise you will brick your device. We will use the adb shell command to run all these commands. After entering set 17 ESP on now. You need to reboot your phone in recovery one time. Now again use adb shell command. Now again copy and paste all the remaining commands. Except the last one, because we are going to use the last command using TWRP terminal. Now move on to the phone. Go to the wipe settings and wipe your internal storage to use internal storage. Or to boot into Android. Now reboot your phone into the TWRP again and open the terminal. Now connect your pen drive to your phone using OTG. And copy the 2OH to PE bootable file into the phone partition that we have made. To copy use the last command. After formatting reboot your phone into an inactive slot. Example currently in my phone B slot is active and a slot is inactive so. 
I will boot my phone into a slot. But to not reboot completely into the system just make slot A as active slot and boot into the fast boot mode. Now after all these commands and steps, we need to flash the boot image file to boot the OS. To flash the boot image file go to the directory. Where you have store the boot image file use these commands fast boot flash boot boot dot image. Now reboot your phone and you will see one new interface staff. Else you choose various options to boot, we are not done yet. And we still need Windows 11 ISO image in our phone. Now after booting into new boot images, you will see various options to choose from, you have to select the continue to boot option. Using volume up and down keys to navigate the option. And use the power button to select the option. Now you have to make some partitions to install Windows 11. So for that, I will give you one more file for the command you need to copy and paste those commands. In this bootable window, just copy and paste the command till exit commands. Do not copy last three commands because we will use those commands later. Find Dism++ software. We'll use this software to install the ISO file of Windows 11. After opening the application click on the files. On the top left corner and click on apply image or mount image option. Now select the ISO file from the pen drive. And select the drive in which you want to install. In my case, it's drive D. Where I'm going to install Windows 11. After both the steps click on the add boot option. Now click on OK. Now it will start installing Windows 11 on your device. It will take 15 to 20 minutes so be patient. After the installation process is completely one, click on OK. And after that click on the open session. Now here select the drivers. Now here click on the add button to install the drivers. You need to select drivers according to your phone OnePlus 6. And the OnePlus 60 have different drivers. After selecting drivers click on OK. After that it will take 2 to 3 minutes to install the drivers. Now after all these things you can now close all the tabs and Now this is the time when We are going to run the last three remaining commands After entering the last three commands Your phone will shoot down automatically You need to boot your phone manually After rebooting your device you will see one more option there Called Windows Boot Manager So you will need to boot your device into that option after that it will start preparing all the installation process to run the Windows 11 on OnePlus device. It will take about 20 to 25 minutes to install so be patient. After installation it will boot into the setup page. So you need to complete this setup page. Let me quickly set up this. Now you can see it has booted into Windows 11. So this is it. For this video, thanks for watching.